Do you like pineapple on your pizza? <laughs> yes. Okay. <laughs> Why? Hello, everybody. It's Brooklyn, obviously, and these are my very cool roommates. This is Maudi. And this is Rachel. And I thought I'd film kind of like a introducing my roommate slash we answer a bunch of questions. Um, yeah. I'll say we can both discuss where I met both of you. Uh, we met a couple of years ago. What was that? Fall of 2019? I think no. so. Was it? You lived in Georgia yeah. and I lived in Texas. You were in Utah for something and I was in Utah for something. And we happened to get ice cream at the same time in an ice cream shop and I recognized them but I was confused because I was like, they don't live in Utah. Why are they here? So I like went up to them. I was like, are you guys from Brooklyn? Maybe they're like, yeah. And then we like ate our ice cream, whatever. And then like 30 minutes later, someone was like, do you guys want to hang out? Do you want to go bowling? or something and they said yes. That was actually the first time I ever saw Tristan and I cake in real life. So yeah. we never actually said hi to each other and we both acknowledged it as soon as we left on Instagram, but we <laughs> saw each other in there. And then ever since then we kind of kept in contact. We saw each other one other time and then when I moved here we lived together. Yeah. So that's the story about how <laughs> I met Rachel in very short terms. Yep. How I met Maudie. I went on Facebook and I picked a random house to live Same in. Same with me, I'm not gonna room. lie. And then I showed up <laughs> And Maudi was my roommate. So this was the first time like I really tried to find people to live with that were like my friends or my family or my cousins or something. And I kid you not, I probably had four or five different living situations fall through. And I was just like, clearly I'm meant to live with people I don't know. Like clearly that's how this is supposed to go. You guys want to say a little bit about yourself so they kind of like know like who you are, what you're doing in Utah, like how old you are, anything like that. <laughs> Whatever okay. you feel comfortable with. I'm 24. I'm from here. Utah was born and raised. Uh, I love sports. That's literally all I do. Like, stuff. like I'm always she plays soccer like every night. I know. Stuff going on all the time. Yeah. Um, I love to dance. I love sports. I love music. And then me, I'm 21. Um, I've been in Utah for a couple months. I moved here from Georgia. I'm still trying to figure out why I'm here. I have no idea. <laughs> I tried to move to Texas, but like nothing worked out. And so I was like, okay, let's try Utah. She's following me, guys. <laughs> yeah, I am, I am. So yeah, I'm, I'm just in Utah, just hanging right now. I... Okay, so I asked Instagram like what some questions were that they like wanted us to answer like as roommates. This one says, how long do you guys plan on living with each other? Forever. Oh, uh, whatever, whatever. I actually finished school in March. Let's not talk about it. <laughs> And I'm probably going to move back to Texas once that school is kind of over and done with. So it'll be like another like year or so. What age did you have your first kiss? I was little. I was 16. I don't remember. It was that unmemorable. Yeah, honestly it was. <laughs> you don't even remember? Dang. Oh my God. I don't even like Do you ever use each other's things? <laughs> yeah, in the kitchen we I like see yeah. everyone's like Jen. Like, sometimes hot. I'm like I probably eat somebody's food. Like I think yeah. it's mine, but like <laughs> we don't really know. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> they, we all have separate rooms. Yeah. yeah. So I, it's not like I go like into Maddie's room. I'm like, where's your yellow pinstripe shirt? Like <laughs> I don't. I haven't done that yet. <laughs> what is our nighttime or like yeah nighttime routine? <laughs> well, here's the thing. Brooklyn likes to stay up late. Oh my gosh, <laughs> late. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, and I don't as much. Maudie kind of. So it depends. I survive. It depends. Yeah, yeah. And so it's like we all kind of do our own thing, and some nights we do things together, and then sometimes it's, oh Rachel's been in bed in bed for two hours. Yeah. yeah. And Brooklyn's like let's watch a movie, and we're like and then no, yeah. I, fall, I fall asleep first, like <laughs> yeah. <laughs> then, well, they both like <laughs> neither of them are like super super night owls. Maudie's more than Rachel, yeah. but so like we kind of all just collectively collect into the living room or yeah. the kitchen, and usually we're like talking. Sometimes we'll watch a movie. Like we just went bowling and like had dinner the other night. Do any of us have boyfriends? <laughs> I'm gonna go. <laughs> <laughs> Does Brooklyn annoy you with all her YouTube stuff? <laughs> no. I feel like I really don't do that much. <laughs> like no, I, I don't like like flash my camera around. And, like, no. Except when I have to me. move my whole workstation. <laughs> Huge workstation in the living room, which did not bother me at all. In fact, I kind of missed it when she left. <laughs> I know, same. She wasn't in the living room all the time anymore. But I had to film my freaking house tour, and so we had to like move it and then move it back in so the middle of the tour. Brooklyn's like in the back filming, and Maddie and I are trying to move it like super quiet and like not crash around <laughs> like, and not break the computers. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> this one says, "Who has the best taste in guys?" Me. No, maybe not. <laughs> Yeah, honestly. <laughs> Historically. Who is the 
the messiest? I don't feel like any of us are yeah. super messy. I feel Honestly, like we're yeah. really clean. Like we keep the common space really clean. Do you guys have jobs? And if so, where? And what do you do? Yeah, but I don't know what it is. <laughs> she works, but she doesn't know really like, what she does. I don't know how to explain it. The short version is I schedule appointments and assign appointments out to our to my coworkers. Um, I'm a substitute teacher. I've been subbing for like almost two years. This is, was it ever awkward, like, when you didn't know each other that well? For me personally, no, because no. I feel like it's easy. You just figure yeah. it out. You just, yeah. like, are living with people, and so yeah. you just, like, become friends. <laughs> okay, y'all, we, camera battery died, so that's what happened. But I did We're find back. some more questions. This one asks, what's your funniest date story? Oh. Or, like, worst date story. It was, this was so long ago, but it was during prom. <laughs> And my date, he had to call his parents to come pick us up in his minivan at like 12 at night because he's like, oh, uh, I forgot. I don't have a license. And I was like, oh, oh he forgot. I, uh, we were friends. I was under the impression we were friends. And like, we ended up driving down this, like, he's like, I want to take you to this, like, special place. And then we ended up driving down this, like, dirt road. And it started raining. And he was in a truck, and the truck got stuck in the mud. He, like, gets out and, like, tries to push the truck out of the mud. It's not getting out of the mud. He's covered in mud. I'm, like, sitting in the truck. I was like, we, we should probably talk. Because I was, like, starting to get vibes that, like, maybe he was, like, trying to romantically pursue me. Oh. And we got on the roof, and before I could say anything, oh, no. oh, no. it was just bam, no, no. straight in to kiss me. I was like, we're just friends, and he was like, poor guy. Oh, <laughs> and the worst part was that we were still stuck in the mud, <laughs> and there was no way for us to get home. Do you guys like Finn? Yeah. <laughs> Who does it? <laughs> He's a sweet Finn. dog. Rachel's allergic to all dogs except not Finn. Finn. He's so. like a miracle. He's a miracle dog. I was worried, like moving in, I was worried that I would be allergic to him. Nothing. Not a problem. Yeah. Nothing at all. He's a sweetie. Rachel had a collection of questions. Where did those go? Do you believe in love for sight? No. 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 I do. Because I watched <laughs> Asa oh, no. literally fall in love with Bailey the first second he saw her. That's actually the most That's so cute. Thing I know. Do you like pineapple on your pineapple? <laughs> yes. Okay. Brooklyn. <laughs> Just kidding. Yeah. Why? Why? What's your reason? Yes. No. Fruit is its one category and it does not cross over into other categories. I don't eat dessert with fruit. I don't eat like what? fruit on pizza. It gives pe the pizza yeah. such a good flavor. No. Oh. All right, well, oh thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you got to know my roommates a little bit better and just see how much I love them. Um, and that's all. So I'll see you guys next week. Bye. Ah.